Hello, Iron Man viewers. I am Imogen Simmons. Welcome to my house. No. <laughs> We're in Florida. I'm Florida. In Panama City Beach. Uh, so you got third at the Ironman European Championship. Yes. You got your Kona slot. I got my, well, my Utah slot, yes. Your Utah slot. So you're aiming for a Kona slot. I mean, yeah, I guess everyone is, apart from a couple who've already got it. So yeah, that's that's the aim. But also, kind of just thought that since I was going to be racing a, an Ironman at this time of year, as it was meant to be Kona, then why not give another one a crack? Bis Juicy. I haven't raced a flat course really this year, like even Finland, which was European champs, was like 16, 1800 meters climbing. Um, so yeah, I rode the course today and I was like, oh, this is very flat, um, much flatter than any single road in Switzerland, I think. And then the bike course just like, I haven't ridden a flat course well before. So I'm kind of excited to do that over an Ironman distance. Okay, time to run. It's also a question of the heat, like the actual air temperature is not hot, but the sun is shining. Um, so we'll see how we'll see how the run run goes. I haven't I haven't nailed an Ironman run yet, so that's honestly one of my my important points on my list. How's the travel? All 19 hours of it, airplane time. I mean, to be honest, this, this is like a really strong field. It's it's impressive. I was like. When I signed up for it, it wasn't quite as an extensive list, so it's it's always fun to, to race the best. Quite a lot to, to watch out for, quite a lot of movement to, to watch. Welcome to <laughs> sunny, hot, not so hot Florida. I was interested in Ironman Florida because Florida is notoriously a very fast course. <gasps> Priorities. <laughs> All right, address. <laughs> this is me attempting to trash talk. Well, I love racing Heather Jackson because we're friends and we have a lot of inside jokes. There's also some European women I've never really raced. We got a lot of strong American women and then some people coming over for the chance at you know, two Kona slots and it'd be cool to see them as well. <laughs> Actually, I think that there's so many women racing that it almost makes it better because you're not like, well, this person is going to do this and this person's going to do that. I think we don't really know what's going to happen, especially with like late season racing. I feel like um, you never really know where people are at. And for me personally, I actually haven't raced since Ironman Port Lane, which was June. So um part of me is like this is gonna go awesome and then the other part of me there's like a question mark of you're like am i ready like you know i haven't raced in a while so we'll see i have learned there of like under fueling because i wasn't ready for the cold so i'm gonna try to mitigate being cold and stay as warm as i can i'll wear long sleeves or arm warmers if i have to on the bike and adjust my nutrition accordingly but we all race the same course i mean obviously i would rather be in hawaii not gonna lie <laughs> in a really hot race but um i don't know cool conditions lend itself to fast conditions so um i think we're gonna see some fast racing if the weather stays favorable Hi, I'm Heather Jackson. We are in Panama City Beach, Florida. And so you're going for the Kona slot? I am going for the <laughs> Kona World Champs October Kona slot, yes. We have a super deep women's field here, so excited about that. Um, yeah, I mean, I actually don't know 100% who is actually here because the Ironman Florida start list and the Ironman Cozumel start list are pretty identical. So <laughs> I think everyone, there are three left, Florida, Cozumel, and South Africa. So I think everyone kind of signed up for all of them. I love that the competition in the women's field is rising. Like every year it's getting better and better. More and more people are coming up to the, the full distance. I'm not good at responding to <laughs> 
<laughs> smack talking. I love it. I think it's great for women's sport. Uh, I try to like do it. I try to get better at it, but <laughs> I'm just not good at it. <laughs> all right, what are we doing today? What do we got on tap for training? If I see a fin, I'll run in the water. That's all I do. Well, I have to swim. I may go out here just to get in the wetsuit, practice some open water. Um, or we might head to the pool <laughs> if I <laughs> chicken out. Um, so a swim. A bar. There's rays down here. See, there's rays. Oh my god. I looked at travel to South Africa just because I've heard that's a super hard, hilly, windy, tough course. I'm stuck here with flat, flat fast. So not what I would typically pick, but it's a good new challenge and um, it was easy travel. Um, I've heard actually great things about this course, so um, I'm excited. Uh, it's going to be a great day and like I said in the email, um, I, I'm, I'm in awe of what we do in one day. Returning to Panama City Beach is big for us this year. Uh, we've had a few rough years, uh, 2018 being displaced to Haines City for Hurricane, Hurricane Michael. Uh, 19, we came back, you know, very strong to the community that was really just suffering and, and recovering from the uh, hurricane. Uh, 20, and we undoubtedly we did a double day with our 70.3 Gulf Coast race and our uh, full distance Ironman race here in town. So. This is really, you know, it's kind of, it, we're trying to get back to our normal in Panama City Beach and make the left, make the right rather, go up and start the construction, make a right at 79. You know, we have a morning staff meeting, emails are sent out the night before, kind of the progress of, of the production, if you will. But uh, as far as the machine, it's a well-oiled machine with the, an amazing staff, uh, best in the industry. Uh, area leads, I'm gonna start a group text with Ben. At three o'clock, give us an update on what's left for the day. Today is Godfather's birthday. Today's his birthday. Happy birthday, dear Godfather. This year, we've been waiting about 23 years for a finish line to be at this magnitude, and we are going to be able to pull it off with the best finish line in, in our our history here.